Daniel Bell Flannery saying the explosion that killed her father back in September was preventable and never should have happened. She said it was caused when a bollard was augered into place, slicing open the underground propane line at the Leap facility. Bollards or safety poles are installed to prevent explosions. Video from the scene of the aftermath shows the propane tank and the yellow gas line leading to the building. Farmington Selectman Scott Landry, who's also a State House representative, testified that those bollards were installed next to the Leap Inc. building to protect the exterior heating unit. Landry testifying, if it was an electric line, a water line, even a sewer line, the contractor would have been required to contact DigSafe and this tragedy would have been prevented. And Maine's Fire Marshal Joe Thomas also testifying, saying the explosion at the Leap Inc. facility in Farmington back in September is a clear example of what can result from a breach of an LP gas line that is below ground. Thomas saying, had a formal dig safe assessment been done, clearly marking the location of the supply line, the breaching of the LP gas supply line could have been avoided. Captain Bell's daughter urging the legislative panel to change the current dig safe laws to include liquid propane gas lines, saying, while there could have been so many other tragedies that day, the loss of my dad was enough. Losing him to such a preventable death is enough. Again, all of these investigative details coming out ahead of the official release from the Maine State Police and the Fire Marshal's Office. We expect again that official release to come either later today or tomorrow. Live in the studio, Jim Keefley, WMTW News 8.